کوچک سنگ آب میزد. یک در وقت که سنگ پیدا کردی دکش شروع برش تمام در دام راز آب است لاره دبگو. سنگ گوشت میگرم. و اگروز سنگ میدرق. The story of the patient stone is that there is a mystery. There is a stone, a black stone, that you put it in front of yourself and you tell the stone all your secrets, all your pains, all your problems, and the stone hears you, hears you, hears you, and one day the, the, the stone explodes, and that day you are free. And the story is related to this woman because this woman finds out that her husband that is half dead, we don't know, he's in coma with open eyes. She finds out that this man, this husband can be her patient stone and she starts telling all her secrets to her husband and um, the end of the story I won't tell. <laughs> هیچ وقت به گپم گوش نکردی هیچ وقت ده سال از روسه کردیم تو میفهمید اینجا خط جنگ میشه با سلا بخش میکنه به جنگ میره خوشحال است At the beginning she, she's just a housewife then she hates him because she wants him to die and then she finds out that she can liberate herself by, by this husband and then she falls in love with this dead body and then at the end uh, she, she becomes free in a way. So there's thousands of dimensions in this character in the movie we cannot say black and white this is it, this is that. It's sort of a monologue, it's like a one woman show because she speaks with herself all the time and she goes through lots of ups and downs and challenges and she starts from point zero, she goes to million in, in one, hour, one hour and a half. So the, this crescendo, it's really big. It's not like the evolution is not small, it's really huge. The director is a writer of the novel, of the book and also the writer of the script with Jean-Claude Carrière and also the director. So he was the creator and he was giving me whatever I needed. So we tried to do art and he was the director as the director is in the, the word to direct you to find the path towards this role and whatever you're doing.